Hi guys, what's up? Turbo Logo here, and today we are back with the World Cup game, randomized World Cups. You know how it is on this channel. I always play like literally the same game all the, over and over. I uh, just thought for a Friday video, we'll do this because it's the easiest thing I can do. Um, so yeah, let's get started. Let's see who we get, even though you'll know from the title of the video. Let's go. Who are we going to get? We got Vanuatu. We'll take it. We'll take it. I like a little bit of Vanuatu. You know, I never actually thought, I never knew they actually existed up until until like these games so this game is actually really good in like um, you know seeing like what nations there are in the world and like you know what geography there are and you know stuff like that you, you learn on this game you do you know and who says video games can't be educational right I think this is how I got my flag knowledge speed through these because I am at the very bottom so it doesn't matter who goes in which Bosnia and that one Venezuela Romania Turkey Mali Honduras, Korea Republic and Austria, right, this is the one we're after, this is the one we're in. Congo DR in Group A, Oman in Group B, Moldova in C, Liberia in D, Kuwait in E, Panama in F, Vanuatu in G, and Azerbaijan in H. So we've got Italy, Chile and Korea Republic, we'll take that. We are the weakest team in the whole group. How about that? And we got to beat the likes of Italy. Nice one. I already did one with Tonga um, not too long ago, and I, I didn't do that well with them. So maybe um, this one won't be a very good gameplay. I don't know. <laughs> That's very um, promising, isn't it? Saying on your own video, oh, it's not going to be very good this time around. All right, here we go then. Vanuatu versus Korea Republic. I have no idea what Vanuatu are all about. Like, like I said, I didn't really know they existed until these games came out. Um, are they any good for football? I mean, obviously not, right? But, like, like, have they actually done anything noteworthy? Or have they been involved in anything, like, um, you know, historic or something? Have they been thrashed 32-0 by Australia? You know, have they done any of that? I don't know. But we're, we're going to play with them. Alright. I don't even know if the team's licensed at this point. Are they? I don't know. Let's play anyway. I think I think Vanuatu are absolutely up for this. Like I can feel that they're that kind of team that I'll probably get on with because they seem to be tackling quite a lot. They seem to be, you know, alert as well. The passing seems to be good. Maybe it's like down to Korea Republic being a little bit bad. I don't know. I mean, back in 2010, Korea Republic weren't that great. Um, they're probably way better now. To you, him. Down there. Across there. Oh, see, I had it planned out in my mind, and yet still. Just couldn't get the finishing touch. What we needed from Vanuatu. Vanuatu. Um, one day we'll qualify for the World Cup. I reckon so. <laughs> On what basis, you say? Well, because I want to be their manager one day. You, you know, I reckon that, like... If you move to a place like Vanuatu, right, I've always thought this, if you if you were like really, really into your football, which I am, I love football, obviously. Oh, 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 yes, a little tap in, and Vanuatu score against South Korea, it's Poida with the goal, and that's 1-0, oh, that was a little bit lucky, I mean, I passed it, and then the bad touch, and then those two defenders collided into each other, all I had to do was tap it in, we have got a shock result on our hands. So yeah, like I was saying, um, have you ever thought, like, if you wanted to become an international coach of a team, because you don't have to be that nationality to be a coach, obviously, um, like, have you ever, like, just thought, like, move to a place like, that's a red card, that is a red card all over, that is a red, mm, okay, <laughs> I'm not, no disrespect to any of the nations that I'm suggesting in here, but, like, some of them don't care about football. And, like, you can just go over there and be like, yeah, like, I know a little bit about football. And then, like, play a couple of matches, you know, really feel it out. And there is potential that you could become a manager of these teams. The problem is, is the talent that you have. Like, these people, like, um, don't play football professionally. Most of, most of the time it's amateur football. Oh, wow, that's 2-0. Wow, that's really easy. That's too easy for um, Vanuatu. It's um, Soromon. 
Epcot? Is that the wizard off of um, Lord of the Rings? <laughs> He's actually got the same name, Sauron. I just, that's a random nerdy reference I just um, came up with. This is the shock result of a lifetime for Vanuatu. I just gotta hope that I keep it. Because we got Italy and we got Chile as well. Vanuatu are good. They're, good. they're a good team. They're just sleeping giant. Look at that. See, what is the South Korean defender doing there? And all I have to do is miss the net, empty net. Yep, yeah, that's all I have to do. Oh my god, this guy's through. It's Soroman. The hero that everybody needs. Oh, 3 0. I don't know how he even wrapped his leg around that guy then, but yeah. Look at this. This team is absolutely rinsing South Korea. Vanuatu, of all nations, predicted to finish dead last in the group stage are now 3 0 up in their first game, by the way. So there's no morale or anything like that. <laughs> I don't even know how I'm doing this. This is crazy. No, South Korea. Oh my god. I was quiet for most of that game because uh, nothing was really happening, but they scored a really good goal there. I mean, I just, bad header, and he just twists round, shot, oh, that was luck. You know, if the AR was still around, uh, well, well, around at this point, they would have VAR'd it and they would have ruled it out. Nice, it's a really good win. Vanuatu, of all nations, have absolutely embarrassed South Korea, and I thought, honestly, that it was me that was going to go out. The kits blend into the pitch. The tactics are working so well. Vanuatu, the best nation ever to grace a World Cup. Our next match is against Italy. Italia, Italia. We're against Italy and um, yeah, I'm uh, yeah, not really looking forward to this because the last time I faced Italy in one of these gameplays, they absolutely thumped me. Um, I think that was in like the round of 16 or the quarterfinals or something like that. They they beat me. So I'm not looking forward to that. Actually, on the wing, Cam Broanese, he whips it in. Oh, he just slipped me out in the box, in my own box. Referee's like, none of that, please. There he is, the new Juve manager. What do people think about that? You know, sorry, winning the league, but not winning the Champions League. And Juve are like, right, get out. I, they must have had Perlo on the cards, literally way before, like, you know, they, they're thinking about sacking Sari and, um, you know, they must have had that decision in their minds for ages, not just because of that Champions League loss. Just, you know, he, he's an Italian football legend. Could you imagine if he was, like, managing our team, you know? Like, people love that because that's the current trend, isn't it, right now, is getting ex-players as, um, you know, managers now. You, you see it at Man United, you see it at Chelsea of Lampard, um, you know, Ger well, Gerard's um, at Rangers, but you have to think one day he will be at Liverpool once Klopp's um, done his time. How about um, Atalanta almost getting past the quarterfinals of the Champions League, almost into the semis? I felt so sorry for him because I really, really wanted... Oh, bloody hell, that was a good save. I really wanted Atalanta to do well in the Champions League. They're such an exciting team to watch. They're just good. Oh, my God. <laughs> I knew that was going to happen. La Quinta with the goal against Vanuatu. And I, I, I really have a feeling it's going to be Munich, Bayern Munich. It's got to be. But we'll, only time will tell, you know. I don't know how I feel I'd be like to win in the Champions League. Because they're, again, another one of these clubs that haven't been around for so long. And funded by mega, mega corporation money and shit like that. I mean, all club, most clubs are nowadays, but like, it's because they know, because they're new. People just hate them. I just, I just don't want City seeing. What the fuck? Did you see that? Perlo just scored an overhead from an overhead um, kick assist. He did an overhead, and then he did an overhead. That is a that is mental. One of the most bizarre goals I've ever seen. He he gets it. He's like, yeah, I'll scissor it. And then Perlo's like, I'll scissor it as well. Straight in. Probably one of the greatest goals I've ever seen. And I'm two 0 down against Italy. Well, half time, and we're two 0 down. Fantastic. We have to beat Chile now. Oh my God, Italy, you're just too good, aren't you? You're way too good. Now, that is a good ball, but I reckon I'll get caught up here. Yeah. 
I knew I would. Like, Italy just didn't want to let me pass at all, which is fine. But, I mean, I expected it, but I didn't want to expect it. I wanted a little bit unexpected result. Oh my god, no. Oh, everything was fine until Italy came along. Everything was fine. I literally smashed South Korea, and then Italy came along and gave me a footballing lesson. I just couldn't even stop that. My god. We're just going to have to shoot from the centre circle and see if it goes straight in. Oh my god! <laughs> Imagine that, Vanuatu are like, fuck this, shoot from the centre circle and see if it goes straight in. And it almost did! It almost caught Buffon out. Wow. The balls to have to take that kind of shot. Oh, go on. Oh, I think that's game over anyway. Well, that was Vanuatu's shot. Could you imagine if that had gone in? Um, what's this one? Portugal and Mexico have already gone through, so that's good, I guess. Um, we already know about those two. Uh, Holland and Bosnia have gone through on that one, Group A. Uh, United States and Norway in Group B. Germany and Romania in Group C. Greece and Switzerland in Group D. Turkey missing out on goal difference, literally by one goal. Wow. Um, Group E, France and Mali go through. Ivory Coast going out. Wow, that's uh, pretty strange. And then Argentina and Honduras. Okay, the final match of the group stage and the most important match is Chile versus Vanuatu. We haven't played Chile yet on this game, I don't think. So it's going to be interesting to see how they do against us. Well, look at that. It's looking lovely, that stadium, all the confetti in that. All the Vanuatu fans are there. All of them from the country. Literally, the whole country should, is there. If that, if that stadium sits about 40,000 people, then that end probably has about 20,000 to um, Vanuatu fans in there, probably, and they're probably, I don't know how, what the population of Vanuatu is, it can't be that big, like this is going to be mental to stop Sanchez, 2010 Sanchez, I wish it was 2017 Sanchez or 18 Sanchez or where, how, what, that's not a pen, I literally slid in front of him, oh my god, are you kidding me? I didn't even press the um, the uh, thingy button. I didn't press the tackle button. All I did was the... Oh, that was such a poor dive by the goalkeeper. Well, Roberto Suazo, is it? Scores? I remember him only for one reason. I used to I used him in an ultimate team once on one of the FIFAs, and he was literally unstoppable um, in my starter squad. No, don't let him get anywhere near. Oh, thank God that I hit the post. Oh, what? That took a deflection. Oh, my God. It was uh, Fernandez. Well, we're definitely out now, aren't we? Look at this. I tried to tackle him. Wouldn't tackle for some reason. Oh, it took a slight deflection off the defender. So took it over the goalkeeper. That's, that's, oh, that's so irritating. Every through ball I do, it just doesn't get latched onto. If I did a normal pass, it doesn't work. So I have to through ball it. Yes, right, we got one back. Could this be the comeback of the season? Probably not. But Italy, why you do that to South Korea? You've already qualified, you don't need to qualify. Oh, hello, 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 hello! Oh, yes, they've rescued it. They have rescued it at the end. That is incredible. What's the minute? The 90th minute, Poyder with the goal, and Chile could be going home, well they are going home, they've only got one point, that defensive mistake, and oh my god, that could have gone wide, that could have gone wide, easily could have gone wide, oh my god, oh yes, that feels so good, that feel. wait, why are they angry, why did they, <laughs> look at the, why are they angry about that? Alright, okay, so I actually got through, there was no glitch, so why were the fans like, you know, <laughs> why are they a little bit like sad, I don't know. Alright, Portugal versus Vanuatu, in the round of 16, we were very lucky to get to here, so I'm quite proud of myself for doing this. Oh, okay, <laughs> okay, Vanuatu coming close there, the world is watching them. Ah, oh, here we go. We're through. Here comes Soromon. He has to shoot because Pepe's right in front of him. Oh my god. 
He whips it in. Why did the goalkeeper do that? Was it that powerful that he had to like palm it out? Oh yes, that's what we wanted. Poyla, he's throwing goal. Will he do something? Yeah. Oh yes, that's what we wanted. Nice one, Vanuatu. Poyda with the goal, and it's one nil to Vanuatu against Portugal. This is good. This is really good. We have 13 minutes to respond to Vanuatu. Otherwise, they're pretty much screwed. Oh no, this is basically it. Oh yes! There it is! It's Soramon! We beat Portugal 2-0 at the moment, but I lose against Italy 3-0 and I struggle against Chile. What is that all about? This game just doesn't make any sense. Oh, this is good. This is good. We're going to advance to the quarters at this rate. Oh, my God. Musa Faliko. Musa Faliko. Musa Fa... I'm trying to read his name while I'm running from goal. Oh, that was close. There it is. Portugal. Look at that guy doing juggles in the middle of the pitch after losing a game against Vanuatu. <laughs> we are against Mali. Okay. Okay, then Mali in the quarter-final. Right, they beat Argentina 3-0. That is absolutely mad. And we could go against... We could potentially be against Bosnia or Greece. Right, let's try and do Mali in, shall we? I mean, they just beat Argentina 3-0. 3-0. Are you kidding me right now? Okay, Mali seem to be passing the ball about really well. I think they've got the momentum from the, the last uh, win against Argentina. I mean, how on earth did they just beat Argentina 3-0? Oh, please get him. No, oh, thank God for that save. Good save by the goalkeeper. These two sides really shouldn't be in a World Cup quarterfinals, but they are. I mean, I can understand Bosnia and Greece maybe, but these two sides, no way. Okay, here we go. Massa Vuva Kalo. Is that how you say it? I'm reading his name as I'm running down the wing. I'm trying to make him, I'm gonna pronounce his name properly. Over the top. But like, that ball was absolutely ridiculous. Like you cannot have a better ball than that, but the finishing was just so like oh my god. The little toe punt he did. They tricked the goalkeeper but it just went wide. Please don't take me to extra time. If you're gonna do it, just do it now. Header ho oh, ho oh, my God, Marley. So there's full time. It's nil nil. That means it's going to extra time, which is what we didn't want. But it's been a very, very close game between these two. Marley pushing. Oh crap! I can't actually catch this guy up. Oh, there we go. I caught him up. So so random. He was actually right in front of me as well. Marley on the attack. Oh my God! Are you kidding me? That is the last. Oh my god, that is the last of last minute goals. I made a mistake. He crosses it in and he just gives a toe on it and it goes straight in. That's Vanuatu out and Mali are going through. Oh my god. No, they literally got like the golden goal of goal. Like it wasn't even a golden goal, obviously, but literally last minute. Like literally, but I couldn't do anything about it. And Vanuatu are out. God damn. Oh, France beat Greece 3-1 in the final. Holland beat Mali in the third, third place playoff. Okay, so France won the World Cup. So let's have a look at the tables then. So Holland beat Germany 1-0. France beat Italy 3-0. I got that beaten by Mali 1-0. Look at that. Greece, Greece and Bosnia had an epic game. 5-4. And then what happened in the semis? Holland beat France in penalties. Greece beat Mali 3-2. Then Greece went on to lose the final against France. Unlucky to Greece. But yeah, that was your random World Cup with Vanuatu. I came so close to getting to the semi-finals with them. I'm very unlucky. Um, but if you did enjoy the video, then give it a like and subscribe if you're new here. That would be really helpful for me and the channel. Keep it loco, and I'll see you again for the next video.